Hey, hey, country view. This is your Wildcat welcome for Tuesday, November 12th. And we have no birthdays today. Shoot. I know, but it is an topic Tuesday and we are saying a new affirmation for the month of November. Yeah, I see mm -hmm. this. Mm -hmm. The Wildcat promise. Mm -hmm. Wanna say a line and I'll repeat after you? Sure. Okay. I promise to treat my classroom and its people with respect. I promise to treat my classroom and its people with respect. I promise to solve problems and always try my best. I promise to solve problems and always try my best. I promise to tell the truth and take responsibility. I promise to tell the truth and take responsibility. I promise never to give up and be, and be the best person I can be. I promise never to give up and be the best person I can be. I promise to participate and have fun with what we do. I promise to participate and have fun with what we do. I promise I will learn a lot and help others learn lots too. I promise I will learn a lot and help others learn lots too. Wow. I really like the way that this fits in with our expectations of being a learner and being compassionate and being safe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. And then we're still celebrating Native American Heritage Month. Yep. And I think we have a book to check out. Great. Hello, my name is Molly Lari, and I am a third grade teacher at Country View. Today I am sharing another book to honor Native American Heritage Month. It is called My Powerful Hair. It is written by Carol Lindstrom and illustrated by Steph Littlebird. It will be available in the LMC. Carol Lindstrom is Anishinaabe and an enrolled member of the Turtle Mountain Band of Ojibwe. Steph Littlebird is a registered member of Oregon's Grand Ronde, Confederated Tribes. In my powerful hair, a young girl's mom never had long hair. She was told it was too wild. Grandma couldn't have long hair. Hers was taken from her. But the main character can't wait to grow her hair long for herself, for her family, for her connection to her culture and the earth, and to honor the strength and resilience of those who came before her. This is an empowering picture book about family history, self-expression, and reclaiming your identity. As we honor Native American Heritage Month, it is important that we learn about the unique traditions and values that Native American culture has. I love that we have so many of these resources in our library. Yeah, that's what I like too. It's accessible for everybody to check out. Yeah. Well, I'm Miss Lily. And I'm Miss Rush Hour. Make it a terrific Tuesday, friends. And we'll see you at our next Wildcat Welcome. Thank you.